Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a wig review. It has been a while since I have done a wig review on this channel. I want to give you guys a little break because I'm not sure how many of you guys enjoy those. I know a lot of you do, but I know a lot of you are here for the nostalgic videos, the Disney characters. I get it. But today I am going to be bringing to you a wig review from a brand new company and this is from a company called Dol Dolago? Uh, Dolago? Something like that. I don't know, but it's they're the leading hair retailers in the world. That's a very big claim. But it came in this box right here. And this is going to be a really cool tutorial or wig review because I am actually going to be curling the wig on camera because apparently this is 100% human hair, as you can see. So I want to test that theory for you guys, these wigs, depending on the density run from around like a little bit over $100 to I think the maximum price would be at $250. That's what I'm just going to predict because I was looking at the wigs on their website and a lot of them are around $150. I think I saw one for $245 and it just depends on how thick your hair is. So I will be showing you guys how the website looks in the screen grab right here. So this is just the 360 lace wig and this wig right here is going to be 18 inches long as you can see I have my natural hair going right now so it did when I opened the box it looked like this and came with a little booklet Delago and it just talks about the care the return and exchange policy and how many followers they have and a lot of the, their wigs sell on AliExpress. That's, I buy a lot of wigs on AliExpress, so that's good. I see that there's a strap here. I guess you're just going to sew that in if you want a bigger adjustable strap. And like always, a normal wig cap that comes with it. These are when you want to like glue the wig onto the head, but I, would, I don't do that because I work and... In the environment where people would be freaked out if I came in with a new hair color every day. So, and it came in this really long bag, like so. I haven't played with it at all, so you guys are gonna see this really honest review. I went to Los Angeles um, a couple of days ago, and this came in while I was away. So it's, it just looks like this, and it has the lace cut on it still, a lot of lace, and it looks like there are baby hairs right here, and it looks like it's a layered straight wig, it doesn't look too thick, so it doesn't seem like it's going to take too long to curl, but I can't wait to see how this wig curls. So it's all around, like, as you can see, the lace is all over, which means I can probably wear this wig in a ponytail if I wanted to, but it's going to look pretty weird if I don't glue it. So I'm not going to glue it because I'm not going to go out with this and I'm not going to waste glue and all that. But I'm going to put it on like I would any other normal wig. I guess I'm going to have to make my eyebrows darker so they don't look weird. And yeah, let's style this wig together. Before I curl it, I do want to show you how it looks like obviously straight, but I just want to make sure that if this is a human hair wig, it should be able to curl nicely. Okay, before I put this wig on, I want you guys to know that there are three clips. There's one up here at the top and two on the side. And oh, actually no, there's four clips because there's one here at the bottom and then an adjustable strap. Adjustable straps like these are really good quality so this is how you know this is a really good quality wig because it's not one of those cheap adjustable straps these are if you really want to wear this wig for a couple of days you will be able to get away with it so this is already a really good quality wig with all the four clips and the adjustable straps on the inside the full 360 lace and this would be very good if you want to wear this for a week or just a couple of days so, like I said, I'm not going to do the glue. I'm just going to put a wig cap on. And I'm just doing one like this. Now, keep in mind, the wig cap that they did send to you is good if you want to do to wear the wig for a couple of days. So, I am just going to be showing you guys this for a tutorial's purposes. I'm not going out after this. I just got home from work. I just want to chill. So, yeah, I'm just tucking all my hair away. Now I'm just going to take the wig, and what I like to do 
is I like to flip my head and then just take the wig like this. Okay, and then I like to pull it forward, grab the clips on the side. That way it is as tight. It's really tight. Okay, this wig is super tight, which is great because if I want to wear this out, it's not going to be. Okay, it's really tight on the bottom too. I'm going to try to put this adjustable strap on that way. It can be really tight. Okay, so the wig is on and here are the baby hairs. What do you think? Okay, so this is how it looks straight. It comes naturally straight like this. And the baby hairs look really crazy right now because they're not styled, but I think I'm just going to do like a very wavy 80s curl type of thing. Let's just pretend the baby hairs look good, but this is how the wig looks. It's very silky and pretty. Wow, you guys, this looks like real human hair. I feel like Mulan right now. This wig is so soft and so pretty. It looks really realistic. It's scaring me. <laughs> this glue down right here on the side, I think that it would be, I mean, so insanely natural. Like, I feel like Mulan or just kind of Selena vibes right now. It's super soft and it just styles and throws over to the side. Really pretty. You know who I look like? I look like my old self. <laughs> I look like my old high school self. And look at how beautiful and natural it looks when you just put it up in like a half up, half down. I kind of don't even want to curl it because I just love how silky straight it is. But it's always super easy to do a silky straight look. Anyways, so yeah, see how it styles. It, it, my fingers are just running through it. The wig is so tight on that it's not moving anywhere. And like I said, this wig is 18 inches and I'll, I'll show you the length. This wig is 18 inches, so it's not too long, which I like. I hate wigs that are too long. It's silky straight and really beautiful. My fingers are just running through it and there's no shedding so far that I'm aware of. And it was really easy to put up in that half up, half down ponytail. When I did that, it looks super natural. I love it. I absolutely love it. We're just going to try to curl this wig. I am going to be using this curling iron right here. Uh, this is just my Foxy Bay. Uh, I think it's, this is a one and a half inch curling barrel. Everything, all affiliate links will be down below. And I'm also going to use this heat protectant to curl this wig. And we are going to do the test, but so far so good. So I'm just going to put some heat protectant. Also, I'm just gonna take a few pieces right here. But I'm gonna just do some nice beachy waves. So let's see how this curls. My curling iron is hot now, so I'm just curling one piece away from the face. I probably will alternate. It smells a little weird when it's being curled, but we'll see. Oh no, it, it's fine. Okay, that's how it curled so far. That curled better than my hair, I'll tell you that. So this piece, I'm going to curl inwards to have the most body. I'm only doing around 10 seconds and it's curling beautifully. I do apologize for my background. It is horrible because my backdrop completely just fell apart. So, and also my backdrop holder, the one that holds my green screens and all my other backdrops broke. So right now my background looks really plain and horrible, 
but I'm gonna try to get it fixed before my next video. That is how the other curls. So this wig is already curling magnificently, so gorgeously. I have had human hair wigs in the past that as soon as you curled them, they would frizz up and get ugly. So that's how you know it wasn't 100% human hair and they blended it with something else, which is really sketchy because they're charging you for full human hair. And I did, like, I did have some of those wigs companies send those wigs to me. And I had to just like not even post it because I was like, I'm not going to have you guys even get near those type of companies. So, yeah. This wig is curling very beautiful, beautifully. Like the top part is freaking me out because it looks like my real hair. And that's just what's kind of scary. I'm just curling the baby hairs a little bit. I might slick them down. I'm still debating whether or not I should or just leave them kind of like that. So I'm just going to take another section. I don't know what you got, what your you guys' opinions are, but I personally like thinner wigs because they're so much easier to style. Thick wigs are just hard and then they get really tangled easily. Then I have to throw them away most of the time because the tangles are like impossible to get rid of. And I've done every remedy and they still don't untangle, so yeah. But yeah, these waves are coming out red, really beautiful. Okay, so this is a beachy wave. Uh, wand so it's not going to give me super super tight curls i don't like tight curls so i usually always go for beachy waves okay so i got a fairly big piece and i'm going to show you how good it's curling okay so that is the piece nice and pretty inwards and outwards so the hair doesn't tangle into each other that's the worst. I hate the way that looks. So the wig is curled now completely so it's still kind of hot but this is how it curled so I'm just going to comb out a few pieces like this side is completely no shedding at, there is absolutely no shedding at all while curling and no shedding while combing and I'm just going to comb out because I want nice loose beachy waves so this is how it curled So it curled beautifully. I love it. It looks so real. I'm freaked out right now by how real it looks. If I do this, it just curled so pretty. Okay, one of these curls fell, so I'm just going to fix that. I love this. This looks like an 80s dream because of the, the baby hairs. They look like bangs. Okay guys, so this wig passed the test. It curled beautifully and it is super soft and easy to style and there is no shedding at all. It combed beautifully. The length is perfect and so is the density of the wig. It's super tight on my head and didn't shift whenever I was changing the direction or whatever I can go like this and the wig still isn't lifting 
I can do that on the other side too and the wig is still not lifting and it looks super natural and beautiful. I love this. I definitely want to wear this one out and maybe vlog with you guys sometime soon. I want to glue this wig on and maybe wear it for a couple of days. I love it. It's not glued in the back yet but if it were it would be very easy like it would be glued like this and it would be very easy to put up in a ponytail but it isn't but if you want to put it up in a half up half down look it's super easy to style and it doesn't tangle so it's do and it looks a hundred percent natural so I'm gonna one last thing before I end this is I'm gonna zoom up to the hairline so you guys can see it and then we'll conclude this wig review. So this is the hairline and these are the baby hairs that come with it. It is extremely natural. And very, very tight. It doesn't really move like most wigs do. And when you part the wig, you can't really see through it either. So if you are legit about wanting to wear this as a wig out every single day then I would really consider it. So that was my wig review for Dolago. I think that's how you say it. All the links will be down below for this website. This wig is fantastic and amazing and I'm going to take some cute pictures in it right now. So yeah, uh, everything will be linked down below and feel free to check them out and give this video a thumbs up and subscribing is always optional if you'd like, but if you want to see more wig reviews then feel free to hit that subscribe button and notification button so you don't miss a video. Alright you guys, I love you and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.